Hello everyone, how is everyone doing? I hope by his grace we are doing well. So today we are making some quick and easy corned beef stew with yam. Very nice, if I do say so myself. Very, very nice. Chale unye ne bayebi anu huwa tonako. Puna, pa, pa, pa. Oh dear, ye me stew yibi yohun. And come back and tell me if I'm lying. Now let me show you how to make this simple stew. Here I've got kind of corned beef that I've put in here. So with that, we're going to break these two eggs into it and then we will fry it. So let's break the egg. Into so I like to break the egg in a separate bowl just in case. Oh, there are some shells you can get it and you mix. I might add one more egg to it because the corned beef is quite a lot. So that's it. We're going to fry this and then we'll be getting along with it. So in my pan, we're going to now. Fry our corned beef. You can scoop it any size you fancy. So I'm going to scoop them whilst we are frying our corned beef. I've got some onion. So my hard boiled eggs is done. I'm going to remove them, switch off the heat, and then we we'll cut with the two. This same oil, I'm going to put in my sliced onions. oil saute for about five minutes and then we'll just add in our blended tomatoes rosemary oregano garlic ginger in here so guys i've got the oil of tuna fish in a can going in there never throw those things away most especially the oil and I've got mackerel sardine also the oil it gives it flavor and of course sardine itself in here never throw them away or always use it to fry the onions if you are using any um, sardine mackerel or tuna always use the oil to fry the onion don't use it when the stew or don't add it with the oil when the stew is cooking so once you fry it all together with the onions it takes all the fishy smell off so we're going to let it cook for another three minutes and then we'll add in our tomatoes. Whilst that's going on, I've got in here some melon seeds that I have soaked in water. I'm going to blend. I'm now going to add in my blended tomatoes, garlic, ginger, rosemary and some oregano. That's all the spice I'm going to add in here. And so they are setting food that when you are cooking, you don't need 
to put some my spices into it the simpler it is the nicer the food is so let's give it a stir and then I'll rinse the blender with small amount of water and then we'll come back so whilst our stew is cooking my melon seed or akatua agusi whatever name you want to give it is all accepted I'm going to blend it seed when you are blending I've added in some half sliced onions that's what's going in there before we blend and then don't forget to add in your salt so I'm going to add in some salt and then we'll blend of course adding the onions give it flavor in the uh, what do you call it uh, okay we're checking on the stew and giving it a stir it's time for us to add in our sardine china goes Added in my tuna sardine, tuna sardine, and mackerel. I've added it in here now. I'm going to let it cook for another five to ten minutes, and before I add in my melon seed, blended melon seed. We cover it and continue. Mm -hmm. so we're going to give the stew a stir and we'll be adding in our melon seed, lowering the heat. stirring it okay we're going to give our piece of stew a stir um, <laughs> shall i say i haven't added in the corned beef yet so just take a <laughs> busy stir okay minute so I'm going to cover it again and give it 10 minutes to we'll add in our beef or corn beef all right guys so I've got some of leftovers from the corn beef so we then add it into the stew with your hands, of course. Test that. Wow, we should stay here. I don't know. Wow, we should not. Oh, yeah, any bayou, it's yam, fried yam. Sorry, boiled yam. And back with you, Rob. I'm going to feed you. This is some corned beef, fried corned beef, and fried hard boiled eggs. <laughs> so I'm going to add in our corned beef and the eggs in here. In it goes. And we give it a stir. Hmm. Ah, she. Here we go, Katrina. 
Mm, sister gay. Uh, she sister gay, yeah. I'm going to jump now. I'm going to cry in the US too. In fact, I'm taking that. I'm going to be me. I'm going to be me if I say me. Yeah. So we're going to let it simmer for five minutes and that's it. We are done. All right, guys. So I'm now going to add in salt. Because I haven't added any. Another five minutes and our fresh will be done. See you in my next video. Thank you. Bye. Please subscribe if you've not done so. And to my subscribers, thank you. Bye.